Where the fuck? Yeah. Yeah. Whatever happened last season, it was just a joke. I, re I refuse to believe that my team is now dissipated and gone. <laughs> anyway, let's get this shit started. Let's do this shit. Oh look, it's Nashville. Five, the logo. What about they're going to do different this year? God, I mean that jersey. I want to buy that one. I absolutely love that Vancouver Canucks skate jersey. I was supposed to, like, fun fact, I literally was about to buy that he, that uh, Canucks alternate, like, around five or six months ago when it came out. I bought it, then I immediately refunded my money because I was having financial issues, so now I don't have no choice but to buy a fucking Fanatics version, and I am sad. But then I am getting the Ducks one. Doesn't really matter. God. Built with the players? What do you mean by that? What do you mean, like, do motion capture? Hasn't that been thing since, like, the 2000s? Is that, like, game graphic? Well, first I thought it was live action. It's actually, like, in-game graphics. That's impressive. You can actually see the beard particles on his uh, chin. Very well defined. Like, the, I think the Frostbite engine is really good. I'm coming hard. Built to change the game, sure. Just like how, for some reason, they're putting in Luke Hughes. Hello there. Despite the fact because he's only been drafted this season. Okay. Wait, no way! Oh! Actually, it's a cool gimmick because brothers, they all come into the league together. That is actually unheard of. Introducing. Nigga, what the fuck does Ice Cube mean? Ice Cube? That's literally just another buzzword for like. Let's just have like the new next gen tech or something to make the game sound more innovative than it actually is or something. It's like, it's a whole lot of fucking bullshit. It's a whole lot of nothing. Just to, I don't know, give the game a bit more staying power even though it's the same fucking game every year. And people are stupid enough to pay full price for it. Like people like Nashville, ah! that's his job. So whatever. Isn't like NBA 2K doing the same thing with the whole they literally just took footage of real players and just motion captured them to the game? Didn't really change much of the gameplay, just very slightly in terms of animations. What the fuck is going on with Minyama? Parade, time, and space, next gen. What the fuck does any of that mean? I could do that same thing in NHL 12 or something. Yes. PlayStation 3. Scale like the pros, over 250 new animations, which are all just gonna be very fucking subtle. You will not notice it unless you look very deeply. It just enhances the gameplay slightly, it doesn't really mean anything. Hockey is crayon on his edges. Very hip. Hockey's Jack on the rush, that's true because Jack Hughes is an amazing refresher. Saw him in the stadium series, he was amazing. Hell yeah. He's probably going to be one of my players that will support this year alongside Zegris and Ovechkin. So yeah, that's cool. Hockey is Luke in transition. <laughs> Hockey's Ice Cube yeah. movie. What the fuck is that? Billy. <sighs> Look at those fucking dumbass jerseys, man. Fuck off. Look at those jerseys. Man, just look at them. What is this design? What is this design? I know it's just a transition period, but the Seattle Kraken had their first ones when they first came to the league and they perfected it. The Knights did their first year, perfected it. Why the fuck is Utah? Oh, guess what? Maybe because the whole move was fucking rushed. Happy that Alex is gone. But now our team is stuck in limbo. We probably won't get... What am I even talking about? I'm talking about NHL 25. You know what? I'll save the rent for later. Hockey is chill with the squad. Fuck <laughs> off. Oh. Hockey's playoff history, of course, that's literally the same of any fucking sport. Family legacies. Get it? The Hugh brothers. Changing on the fly. Heated rivalries. I mean, my team, we're dead, so whatever. I Edge work. Inspiration, legendary. I mean, that's... That's true. I can't say I was, I was. I was about to say it's debatable, but like, nah, man. The sport is fucking golded. It's Canucks. You sneaky motherfucker. This game was developed by Vancouver-based studio, so they have a sneak in. It is our time. It's that is my, my turn. turn. You gotta be the biggest fucking Neanderthal to actually pre-order a fucking sport game. And I know who's that Neanderthal. Definitely, I'm not gonna name the name, but you guys know who it is. It starts with an N and it ends with an R, a hard R. You know who that nigga is. CBG. CBG. I, I don't hate that guy. Just like any other NHL influencer, but whatever. 
Except for the hockey guy. He is golded. Anyway, that's the trailer for NHL 24. And I gotta say, man, this literally looks the same as NHL 24. In fact, it looks like NHL 22 when they made it to next gen. Like, this is like, bro, they're literally advertising better physics and animations. As if that's gonna improve the game. They said they want to revamp the franchise, but it's like, is that enough to pay like full price for a fucking NHL game mode? That you're actually able to have a better franchise mode where you can just go and download NHL 9 on your PC and literally play a fully featured franchise or just grab your old console, play a fully featured franchise, play NHL 14, get a fully featured franchise? This one's like, it's all about the huts. Look at look at the pre-order screens. About pre-order, you got seven days early access. Are you decreased? That's Nigerian slang for saying, are you absolutely out of your fucking mind? You got fucking intro points. HUD wildcard. The cover athletes all about the HUD. Money talk. This is all about that damn multiplayer. I don't know, all I gotta say is you're gonna pre-order the game, you're the part of the problem. And if they just stop making these games, that might be for the better, because honestly, but honestly, I don't know man, this game. I'm not buying it. I'm not buying the fucking game. I mean, the last one I bought was HL24. That's because the last two I ever played with this team, this beautiful team right here. Get his not, team not, 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 not. be presented with In official terms, that's not part of create team mode. So, they're so back. Instead, they're so gone. This whole franchise used to be amazing. It used to be peak in like 2013, HL14. Then after that, year after year after year, it gets worse and worse, so absolutely, I beg you guys, I beg you all, do not buy this fucking game. Do not buy NHL 25. Just play the old games, just play the old years, man, just play the old years. That's what I'm doing, that is my strategy, I'm not gonna play any of these games, I don't wanna give EA my money. So no, just stop playing these godforsaken games, man, just do something else, become a family, man. Pawn hockey or something, smoke a joint, joint or something. I don't fucking know. Just don't play this damn game. Anyway, if you like the video, please give it a like, comment, sub. That'll be great. Nice guys.